this is Genesis chapter 13, and it's the promise to Abram, starting with chapter 13, verse, verse 1. So let's begin. And Abram went, went out of Egypt, he and his white wife. And all that he had and Lot went with him into the south. And Abram was very rich in cattle, in silver and gold. And he went on his journey from the south even to Bethel. Unto the place where his tent had been at the beginning between Bethel and Hai. Unto the, unto the place of the altar, which he had made there at the first. And there Abram called the name of the Lord. And Lot also, which went with Abram, had flocks and, and herds and tents. And the lamb was not able to bear them, that they might dwell together, for their substance was great, so that they could not dwell together. And there was a strife before, between the herdmen of Abram's cattle, and the herdmen of Lot's cattle, and the Canaanites, and the and the Preserites dwelled then in the land. And Abram said unto Lot, Let there be no strife, I pray thee, between me and there in thee, and between my herdmen and thy herdmen, for we brethren. Is not the whole land before thee. Separate thyself, I pray thee, for me, if thou wilt take fr from me, <clears throat> if thou wilt take the left hand, then I will go to the right. Or if Thou depart to the right hand, then I will go to the left. And Lot lifted up his eyes and beheld all the all the plain of Jordan. And it was well watered everywhere before the Lord destroyed Sodom and Gomorrah, even as the garden of the Lord. Like the land of Egypt, as thou comest unto Zor. Then Lot chose him all the plain of Jordan, and Lot journeyed east, and they separated themselves, the one from the other. Abram dwelled in the land of Canaan, and Lot dwelled in the cities of the plain and pitched his tent. Towards Sodom. But the men of Sodom were wicked and sinners. Before the Lord exceedingly. And the Lord said unto Abram. After Lot was separated from him. Lift up now thine eyes, and look from the place where thou hast northward, and southward, and eastward, and westward. For all the land which thou seest to thee, I will give it, and to thy seed for ever. And I will make thy seed as the dust of the earth. 
so that if a man could number the dust of the earth, then shall thy seed also be numbered. Arise, walk through the land in the length of it, and in the breadth of it, for I will give it unto thee. Then Abram removed his tent and came and dwelt in the plain of Marmor, which is in Hebron, and built there an altar unto the Lord. Hmm. Very interesting. So now, we learn in chapter, chapter 13, Abram went south even to Bethel unto his tent place. He had an altar that was in Bethel and I. Then Lot went to the east. Abram went to went to Canaan. The place. The men that were in the story. The men that were in this um this reading. They were sinners and they were wicked. And then, even, and the Lord assured everything was all right to Abram. And Abram built an altar in Hebron. That's just a summary. That's just a summary of of my of this chapter. This chapter thirteen. And this concludes chapter thirteen. We will soon go into chapter fourteen soon. So anyway. Thank you for watching this video and, and I also have have um also want to put in here that our youth group in this our youth group I will show it later. I will show it in the show. We have youth group every Tuesday night, 6.30. And I would like to invite you to come. If you can come to our youth group. If you live in Bakersfield, California. You're welcome to come and learn more. Learn more about the Lord. Wonderful service. Wonderful teachers. 